Chapter 2, Part 4, Mirrored Pillars, Loading. Press Enter to continue. Yes, I will in fact press Enter to continue. <sighs> wow. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bo 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 Another new freaking mechanic. So my strategy for this one? Turn until something works. Both keys must be picked up simultaneously. Fuck. Awesome. Got both of the keys simultaneously. Um. Ooh, I got it, I got it. So I walk down here, and then my gravity changes to that of right here. And I'm in. Yes. Right? Yes, there we go. Not too hard, not too hard. Chapter 2, Part 5, Mirrored Mesolum. Enter. I don't know how long I've been recording. Hope it hasn't been too long. Veil. There is a veil, but there is nothing to be controlled by the veil. What does this button do? Key. Awesome. Alright, um... Okay. My thoughts on this. Put the ball in there. Because if we get in the veil, we can't turn our own gravity. Right. Yeah. So, that would be bad. Because I need to control my own gravity to win this. So what I'm doing is I'm going over here. I'm going to go in this little O shape around the veil. So that I can put the menace ball in the whatever. No, 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 no. Keep going over. Keep, keep going. Keep, there you go. There you go, old buddy, old pal, old friend, old fuck you. Alright. Awesome. Come over here. Bounce. And... I win. Fuck that level. It's too easy. Chapter 2, part whatever. I wrote part Roman numeral, mirrored memorial. <sighs> this looks difficult. Two doors, two people. They're just throwing all the variables at us right now. Oh, uh, why can't. Yeah, I'm touching. Oh, okay. Um. Okay. So. I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna do this. And then. I'm gonna wonder what I just did. No. Ah, uh, darn. Um, key. Yeah. Both keys must be picked up simultaneously. Yes, that is correct. Um, now that he's in the vol. I'm gonna come over here and hit this button so he gets out of it. Or no, not the veil, sorry, the vortex. Vortex. So by the time I walk off this button, he should not do that. Alright. Make a run for it. Son of a bitch. 
There's something I'm missing here. Or is there? Yeah, there's definitely something I'm missing. Um, let's see. Well, maybe what I need to do... Alright, let him get in the veil. No, I don't... I need the veil to be off. And I need that key to get out from the veil. Or I can do this and then completely just win. What do you think I'm doing? My own mind has molded the seed of my downfall. Okay. Cool. I can't touch myself. Awesome. So now I have accessed both doors. Or I've gotten the keys for both doors, I should say. Now I'm gonna go over and hit this button to let my buddy old pal over there get out of the vortex. So I'm gonna let him walk over here. And then... If I do this, I should win, right? Yes. I am so smart. Mirrored Chapter 2 completed. Achievement unlocked, outcast. Two more to go, and another bust. My colleagues suspect something. If they only knew the depth of our work, maybe then we'd be free of this shame. And yet, no. I fear they'd cast us out as heretics, like the great Galileo. Wonderful. I'm sure this has been longer than one episode by now, so... Uh... Or maybe it's just been one episode. But, whatever. Start chapter three. Mirrored chapter twa. Is that guy bleeding out of his eyes? That looks wonderful. Mirrored Inversion. Chapter 3, Part 1. And another triangle. Enter. White door. Lock. Person. Single person. What is that chain leading to? All the way over there. I will find out. Whoa, that's a long chain. Hi! I'll go pick that up. Awesome. That was simple. <laughs> Alright, time to get to the door. Is that it? Oh, wow. Too easy. Too easy, game. Chapter 3, Part 2, Mirrored Timepiece. The shit? Oh, I'm gonna invert so I don't... Can I not invert? I'm so confused. Uh, I'm just gonna turn. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god. This is awful. The ball's gravity is dictated by the clock. Why can't I invert though? That's my question. Can I only invert when...
Alright, well, I'm gonna make a run for it. I did it. I inverted. Oh, well, I can't touch the ball either way. Alright, this is not cool. Alright, wrong way. Uh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, what am I supposed to do? I'm just kind of avoiding it right now. I'm the wrong color. So I can only catch the key up here, but the menace ball will kill me either way. Can't catch it right here. Alright, that's not gonna work. Okay, then. That's cool. Where am I? Oh, there I am. Okay. Alright. All I have to do is get back to the door. Right now. I have to be quicker than that. Alright, well, I messed... I messed that up. <sighs> Alright, make a run for it, make a run for it. Alright. Mirrored Aftermath, Chapter 3, Part 3, cool. That level was very annoying. And death's all over the place. Alright, good, good thing there's no menace ball chasing me this time. Lost the key already. That's great. Um, jump. I died. Is that going to stop it? Okay. Come here, you little shit. Why is there an inverter? Well, I'm gonna do this. Not that. Maybe I should come up here, 
drop over to the starting spot. Right? Cool. Since this has the opposite gravity of me, if I go over here, the key will fall. And that would suck. But it might just work. Let's try it. Because if we keep... Oh, no, no, never mind. I'm an idiot. I am just downright stupid. Awesome. Got the key. Best puzzle solver ever. And we just leave. And I'm awesome. Next level. I'm blowing through this. Chapter 3, Part 4, Mirrored Antique. Hated this level when the clock was working. Okay. Um, can't do that. Keep it fall. So, I'll try and go this way. reset the puzzle and try inverting because that'll take a lot less time than walking all the way back around all right invert and now if I go all the way around can't do that he would fall all right if I go around this way, maybe. Hopefully. I'm just ruling out possibilities here of what I could be doing. That ball can't hurt me. But the question is, will I be able to get the key if I keep walking? Well, the key should fall if I keep walking, right? No, it won't. Okay. So what I'm gonna do... Is I'm going to... Not do that. Gonna... I think I'm gonna invert again. See if I can walk all the way around again. Don't ask me why. Because I say so, that's why. Because I think... What I'm thinking is that it moved one, like, area when I walked around all the way around once. So if I move around twice, will it move around to somewhere where I can get it? Is my theory. So if I do this, if I invert here, then I'll be up there. Yes. And then... The problem is I needed to get it into the same quadrant that my character will be in if I invert. If I invert now, maybe. No. I can't walk around as this guy 
there's no question about it, I have to invert again. Or invert back. I don't think I can walk more this way, because then the key will fall off. Yeah. I'm gonna see what happens. I'm gonna try inverting a couple more times. Let's see what that does. Invert. Alright. Well, now... Can't do that. I can't walk all the way around. Try walking all the way around again, see what that does. Bear with me. I might just edit it, but I'm not sure yet. Whatever I feel like doing. Skip that inverter. If I can. Can I? No. I can't. Have to use this inverter. Because if I don't, nothing will work. I'm and I, I'm pretty sure I'm positive I can't walk around up here as this guy. Alright, I'm definitely editing, editing this. Hold on a minute, guys. I'm going to reset the puzzle so you guys can see what it looks like when I start. And then I'm going to go... I'm going to try and figure this out. <sighs> so, if you'll excuse me.